Hi, it's Karen. And Tim. From Stamping on the Back Porch. Tim just got home. We're running, we're running sorry, around as usual. And sorry that we're late. We were both getting manicures. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, welcome. We're just, you know, the party continues. So, yesterday we did four videos and we have a, there's different accessories that I'm drawing for those. And today we're going to do this. But I'm going to, when Tim is on, actually, Tim, there's an open one of these on the chest in the, you know, the den, whatever, the, whatever that room is called. I don't even know what the room is called. Everything here is a stamping room. Can anyone relate to that? So, you know, that, that thing in the other room. Really, our living room is the uh, YouTube studio. <laughs> Here's the fireplace. And, you know, <laughs> I just take over. I just take over everything. But we're so glad many of you came and watched the party. All you need to do to be entered into the drawings for these things is uh, leave a comment and we love comments that say something kind of about what we're doing so that's really wonderful or questions and today's drawing this will be the last so that means there will be five drawings is going to be for this cute little snowman accessory thing just because he's so cute and I had an extra so um, let's see well I know we're late I says oh, I was trying really hard I thought we were really really had it so thanks and you know you guys know when you come on you have to refresh the screen if we're not on yet so, Tim is going to get that, and tonight at 9 o'clock, I am going to list the the winners of all the the accessories, and so you have to email me is it? your name. Yeah, this is what's inside. It is just adorable. All these little snowman pieces, uh, a little tape. Aren't these just cute? We used them on a Facebook Live a while ago. Hats, mittens, so adorable little accessory. So that will be the fifth drawing. All those will be on tonight. So, yes, we are having a beautiful day here. It is my mom's 95th birthday. That's one of the reasons Tim is home late. He had to stop and get her cake on the way home from working from our, for his daughter-in-law this morning. He cleans and stuff her uh, chiropractic office. So, anyway, um, just <laughs> Patricia placed another order today. She needs part time job. I know, it's, isn't it hilarious? Of course, it's a new month, so it's a new card kit, and... Um, the card kit this month is using the fun leaves. Isn't that fun? How uh, you can put a little leaf inside the big one. So that's the card kit. And um, a bunch of papers came for the paper shares. I'll be sharing pictures. You can still get in on that. And oh, it feels like 115 in Florida today. Oh man, hot weather. It's not, I'm ready. We're going to Duluth tomorrow. We'll be there for two days it's for a funeral for Tim's cousin, who we had mentioned before. And Duluth is one of our favorite places to go, but it's going to be really chilly, chilly up there. We're having cool weather and then it's going to get hot again next week. So, of course, we're going to start with mail. We got mail. We have mail. AOL. Okay, so we'll put this down. Yes, my mom is 95. Down? So that down? is, that is see our, um, our face when we see the surprise. of. It's hard to take my mom out now. And so we are bringing the party to her at her place and so we went to oh we're well, getting just a, moving oh, oh I, I need to share this first we are getting red lobster her favorite meal because she hasn't been there for a year and so for her and her roommate and the family it'll be fun but the party doesn't really end today I wanted to mention this so see it's a good thing this was on the seat next Monday night is my favorite it's a walk through the catalog and I share one card for every stamp set of which if I have one. So I always love doing that and I pick out my very favorites for those. So you'll wanna see that on Monday. And then Wednesday, <laughs> next Wednesday, uh, we're gonna do the same kind of party we did yesterday, but I'm gonna do it over in the back porch stampers. And again, we're gonna have four drawings, four videos, four new little ideas, kind of stuff like we did yesterday. So I have no idea what they'll be, but you know, <laughs> that's, Six days away, so we're really good. <laughs> so thanks for all the birthday wishes for my mom. That, you know, last year was really a really hard year for her, for her, and I shared that, and people sent her so many cards, and you know, she still talks about this. That that was just an awesome thing to do. So maybe if she makes it to ninety six, we'll do that again. So we'll see. Okay, Cel celebrate Carla Hess. Hess. Hess from Orlando. Oh, is this gorgeous? This is to me. Yes, this is a Karen. Oh, is that gorgeous? Look at all the layering with that triple punch. It's just beautiful. And she's got the three 
strip card, three strips. I always call the strip cards because I don't know what else, but um, oh, that's nice. Kathy says walking through the catalog is one of her favorite videos too. That is just gorgeous. And look how she even did the inside. And to see how that, when you use a really soft stamp like that and stamp over it, it's kind of like a watermark on those, you know, those expensive stationery. So I just love that look. That is awesome. Thank you. Another one for me from Patricia Settle in Indiana. <laughs> I got to say her back first. I, I did this uh, on the back. I just like every day may not be good, but there's something good in every day. <laughs> I love it. Look for the good. <laughs> That's great. Oh, and I love this. This B thanks. And you see how she embossed after. She colored it all in and then it's embossed. And she used the, um, oh, the one that goes with the, uh, you you guys will know that kind of that honeycomb thing but isn't that really pretty it's really a striking way to use a folder that's a great idea I love it <laughs> there's nothing better than a friend unless it's a friend with chocolate <laughs> and then she's got her you're a good egg down here <laughs> that's great <laughs> see some of these people decorate the insides of their cards do you I'm terrible about doing that, but Nancy, I really like Nancy. it. Okay, now Nancy even decorated the outside of her envelope. Okay, so see, we're in a contest here, I think. <laughs> this is from Nancy in, um, uh, close here, West St. Paul. Oh, lovely. And look at, lovely Z, kind of a Zephyl cart, but it's a different, um, a different take on it. You know, yesterday when I was talking, when we made, was it yesterday? All this is gonna melt. Yes, when we were making a Z card. And I did mention that, you know, if, well, if you don't like doing one eighths, okay, I'm talking to you, Rebecca. <laughs> you could also do different measurements, but I'm gonna point this out because this is different measurements. Look at this, the back is like this. So I was going to point out an alternative to things. So it kind of doesn't matter. So if you don't like cutting the one eight strips on this, then you know, just cut them differently so that you would cut. I don't know if I'm making any sense. You'll have to tell me if I am, but I love this and I love how this shows. Well, she's got a whole nother thing here. Um, so I'm missing the whole thing, <laughs> but I wanted to come back and just point this out because if this were just a Z fold, look how cool this is. It doesn't have to be Nothing in card making have to be, has to be exact. If it fits in the envelope, it's good, right? But see, this has the whole extra fold, so it's gonna stand up like this. And look how cool that is. It's Z fold with a tail. <laughs> I think this one's turned into an accordion fold. And then she's just written on the sides in there. So, you know, like I like to say, we dwell in possibilities with crafting. So love that, great. This is from a Mary. Layout. Mary, and it's... Fun University. Uh, um, yeah, I, Mary, I, look, I looked up your name because we were emailing back and forth. Would it be, I want to say if you're on, tell me, tell me. <laughs> but anyway. A real nice note. And it's to us. Yes. Right? Oh, and it's lovely. And look, at from my heart, you're the best. Oh, and speaking of, how cool is this? Speaking of Z folds that don't all have to be the same, you know, this isn't the same either. So isn't that fun? So this is called... You know, you can follow directions, but you can also then make a twist on it and make it your own. And sometimes accidents are the best things that happen. So, so I just think this is awesome. So both of these are just very different. That is a gorgeous card. And Mary, I'm sorry, I wrote even- Her last initial is F, Mary. Okay. <laughs> I, I thought it was Mary Gunn, but you know what? Well, there. It might be. Right there, Mary Gunn. Okay, With so we're, we're gonna pretend that. <laughs> Thanks, guys. And so, anyway, so we will continue parting for another week. Did you show this one? Yes. Okay. I think we've showed them all. Okay. So, today, we're going to be yes, using yes. this. And I came up with three cards because I knew Tim was going to be gone. So, he's going to show a fourth. Here's a quick extra idea. So, okay. Now, I think I need a little space. You think so? I need, I need a little personal space here. <laughs> she <laughs> like always says that. Out. Yeah. All right. Yeah, Z folds are easy, but a wow, Donna says. That's so true. And I just, you guys, thanks. I mean, this is so fun. I, just, I love getting cards and, and um, just sharing what's kind of fun and interesting about them. So let's get started with this. I just wanted to pick a, a fun stamp set for today. Yes, this is fun. And I think... Penguins. Playful penguins. 
you know, it makes me think winter. Now there is a merriest wishes on here and may your New Year's dreams come true. <laughs> because they're from a country that has only winter. Yeah, <laughs> but you know, the other words I love. I mean, I just don't think I'll get a lot of use out of them because I would not use these for Christmas, but I love. Always by your side, you're so cool, and nothing warms the heart quite like a good friend. I just think. And then we have the hat, the scarf, and the bow tie, and the little snow or whatever that is in the ground. You're so cool. Anytime you make a card for me, you can just stamp that on it. And so Tim said that, so I'm going to make a card for Tim. Yeah, I thought I would start go. that first, because I saw this stamp set, and I immediately saw okay. him. <laughs> So this is what I'm going to use. I'm gonna use the new acetate, the mercury acetate paper, which is really fun. Oh, Kathy made seven Z folds yesterday. <laughs> that is pretty funny. That I think is... that's a record. I don't think anyone's ever done more than that. Okay, I am going to take this and I am going to cut. You can see how this has some, all these fun lines in it. I The first time I saw this, I looked at it and thought, that looks like ice to me. And so this is kind of like the iceberg that this penguin's gonna be on. So I'm just kind of following it, so it'll just be kind of any which way. And I think I made three, I made a bunch of these, and I think I, I'm trying to remember if I got three or four out of, out of one, I'm thinking it was three. I think it was three, because I think I made the others a little bigger than this one. But, okay, and then to put this on, I was going to use, and probably it would be better to use the multi-purpose glue and it wouldn't show at all, but I found it didn't seem to show. I had one that it kind of showed on, so I'll just do this for speed. And I'm just not hitting these areas that have a lot of blank space. Yes, I expedited my order. I or you, uh, I'll have to post a picture later. I have a bunch of women coming over on Monday that Tim is going to cook for that are going to help me do the paper and ribbon shares. So I had to expedite it to make sure it will be here on Monday. <laughs> so yes, I'm paying extra to get those out. You can still order paper shares; they'll just come on the next one. But I thought, boy, when I get help, I'm just absolutely going to take it. Okay, now you're gonna see in a minute why this is for Tim. Oh, you know what, I'm gonna put this on with glue dots. That's just easier, I like my glue dots. Cause see, I can fit one under each foot. I'll put one up there. And you guys, this is gonna be Tim's winter look. What because you guys know that he wears a actually a vest, a scarf, and a hat. Around the house. <laughs> I think 12, uh, 10 months out of the year why, probably. Why, around. why is that, Karen? Um, who knows why? Because we have an argument that I win all the time about <laughs> That's true. how cold about, the house should be. <laughs> That's true. It's just about anything. I work much better in a cold weather and see it's got this cute little stocking cap but he doesn't quite go that far but you know he's known for his green um what do you call that kind of hat that flat you always hat, wear flat hat. irish flat hat irish flat hat and so this is as close as i can come so it's not quite the same but see this is going to be this is going to be for tim oh that's nice so sometimes you know we just like to make cards that have a story to them okay so there's got his hat and then a court. Oh, I'm going to put it on this. I might as well do that first. So, do you guys make cards? Particularly, you know, do you make a special card kind of for someone, or do you like to mass produce, which is what I, or do you do both? I do. I mostly mass produce, <laughs> except when it's for Facebook Live. But you know. And then I took this. You're so cool. And I. Oh dear, I didn't want to make. Okay, that's okay. It'll be okay. I, it didn't fit a punch, and I didn't really want to put a whole lot of work into it, you know? I mean, he's cool, but, and all that, but, you know, he's not going to appreciate the extra work, right? Maybe he is. So here is my, so I just hand cut it out like that. And sometimes that's even fun if you have several words and you're going to cut them apart. You can make them all different and put them on. So here is my You're So Cool. 
And then I was going to add a couple of little... That is so nice. Isn't that great? See, because we all think Tim's cool. Oh, most of you do both. <laughs> Daddy, you have two wussies in your house, your husband and your son. Oh, see, here he is. Here's Tim with his card. <laughs> here it is. <laughs> it's a... He is so cool. I was going to add a couple gems, but, you know, it stands alone. But doesn't that make great ice? <laughs> That's too funny. All right. Thank you, Tim. We'll have to no. do a photo op no. afterwards. <laughs> thank you. Very nice. That's pretty funny. Okay, now I'm going to do another one. <laughs> Karen, Seth, and you and your husband are just the... I think, you know, I've always been warm-blooded, and I don't know, after menopause, it's like, oh, my goodness, don't give me any heat. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> yeah, perfect heart for Jim, thanks. <laughs> Rebecca says she, her granddaughter's put an order for a card in the mail, and she lives right behind her. Oh, that's, that's great. Okay, so then I saw these, and I wanted to do this because I love the sentiment. Nothing warms the heart quite like a good friend. So this is how I'm gonna make this card. And no, this does not have uh, framelits with it, but I found it's not hard to cut out. So I, I fussy cut a bunch of these when Tim was watching. So to build up my snow, I'm just <laughs> cutting. When Tim was watching. I was watching. <laughs> Tim was watching TV. Yeah, he was yeah. sitting mesmerized was by my cutting out peng penguins. Yeah, right. <laughs> so I'm just gonna take this. I've had years of entertainment. <laughs> yes, that's right. And then I'm just gonna see if this will fit kind of in there. Okay, and then I'll do another one. This, I have to make sure I, I make sure I, oh, well, let's do this one kind of coming down the other way. Okay, and I'll do this. And then I'm going to, okay, so good enough. Then if I just do this on the bottom, I can slip the other ones in behind it and then I can always attach anything I need. Love this paper with the stars. It's part of that, um, ooh, one of you can tell me which that is from. Um, from the beautiful foil paper. It kind of goes with the bells. I'm gonna tuck it in. See, that's why I leave the, oh, Tim is catching me. Okay, then I better do this one. I didn't leave room to tuck it in. No, See, maybe he does sit and watch. He's getting pretty good here at kind of knowing when I mess up. Okay, I'm gonna put this on, and then I'll tuck this one in. Okay. Put plan B. Okay, and then I'm gonna just use my scissors today. I would probably take this and actually do it on my cutter in the other room, because you can see why I waited for this for the last minute. Oh, that doesn't look so good, but sometimes better left alone is better left alone. So now I'll attach this. Tana says, well, her son comes down from his bedroom in shorts and a t-shirt in the middle of winter and tells her the house is cold. <laughs> she says she'll turn the heat up when he pays the bills. That is hilarious. See, in my opinion, you're meant to dress for the winter. So if you are cold-blooded, you know, outerwear on the indoors, outdoor wear is just fine. <laughs> I guess it is. Really you know, there's been this... um. People, when I would do a bunch of classes in my home, there was this running comment that Karen will give you a jacket at the door because you might need one at her house, inside her house. So I did learn to turn up the heat a little bit before parties. But, but isn't this a fun background? And now, of course, I'm just going to put this in because these guys are friends. So I'm just going to do these. I love seeing the comments, but I, I just can't do it, you know, and I'm trying to be good and focused. So here's one, and then here's this other friend right here. So, so far I've used all three penguins. I love that there are three penguins in this. But you can just get such fun variety as of looks here, okay? And I want them kind of, oh, they don't have to be holding hands, but kind of, um, yeah, we'll just put them in there. And we're going to put him right there so and then of course have to add another of these a couple well, we could order a couple of these i love these and 
So we're just going to add a couple up here. And, you know, there was a falling star. So we're going to put a star <laughs> down there. <laughs> Touch the ground. Oh, no. oh, wonderful nights like that, you know. We just need a falling star. Isn't that just fun to play with? So I think these would just be great winter birthday cards, winter, you know, anything winter. These, I think of these as winter penguin cards, <laughs> but not necessarily for any occasion. Okay, and then I have one more, and this is a story. This could be another one for Tim, because um, Tim stories. getting his, uh, he's getting, I work out here today. So I what? am, well, I don't know, you're getting teased today, but this is Tim. Another thing Tim is known for. Here is this couple. I might have made this a little bit crowded. We'll see. If it doesn't work, I'll turn it over. So we have this couple penguin. I don't know why this one's looking away. They don't, um, they don't. <laughs> I should have done it the other way so they really look she, into each other. She okay. is pouting. Oh, and that had a little, a uh, little word to the wise. Sometimes you want to just check, make sure you don't have a little thing on your but that's okay. Um, so what I did with these, because I wanted to mask them, after I stamped, then I just stamped again, right on the edge of a sticky note like this. And when I cut it out, you'll see one because I've already, and then I keep them, and I keep, just tuck them in the inside of this. She actually has a whole room okay. full of <laughs> Yeah, that's right, so they just float around. But I don't know if you can tell in here, but I cut a little bit inside because when you mask, you want to not, you know, there's always that little break where the stamp goes down to the next paper. And I'd rather have it flow into my stamp a little bit than to leave a white space. So you'll see when I cover this up, you can see the little black around there. And then I did this one too. Oh, so... They're having their picture taken. So now you know what Tim's going to do. Tim, do you know what you're going to do? Yeah. And yes, you are known for that. He's going to come in and photobomb. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, so we have to see if this worked. So see how this looks? They're behind. Yeah, <laughs> you guys do that? It's a fun thing. And the cool thing about these post-it notes, look, see, I'll show you. I'll just put it right. Whoa. Oh, look what I did wrong. I did something wrong. No, I didn't go way down to his feet here, but that's okay. I can cover that. I'm sure you Because see, I decided, oh, I wasn't going to go below the feet. Silly me. Oh, do you see how he's photobombed? So now we have a third person in there. And because I really don't want this foot in there, I am just going to... Oh, look at that. It's taken... Care yeah, of, but we gotta have. Anyways. Maybe I have to put a giant gem there. Maybe it's okay. I'm 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 gonna go back wait, to work on this one. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go back to work on this one. Prosthetic. So now, if you look back, what I did wrong <laughs> was on this guy. Right here, I did not cut around. The middle. I didn't cut around the feet because I didn't think anything would would come there. So do you see how? Then it masked that. I may reproduce this for the one that actually goes on this video because it'll just take me a minute after that. But I just want to point that out because sometimes it's good to just see kind of what went wrong unless I can just put a few snowballs there. But so here's the photo bomb. But what I wanted to point out was, <laughs> so here's my other picture about Tim. But this would be a great picture like a uh, card from all of us. You could do a whole bunch of people here. Or thanks to all my friends. You know, anytime is kind of the group nuts. You could do a whole, I think, oh, or even one that's wearing um, scarf. the scarf and hat and then just saying, you know, something about you standing out. So do you see the possibilities with this? We could just really um, um, go ahead and do this. But this is how you would mask for that. <laughs> Oh, run some puff paint over that snow. Hey, there's a good idea. So see, we'll figure something out. But you have the idea. I'll, I'll put up one that's better since this is so easy to do. So, okay. <laughs> yeah, it might be a lot less work. Although you did see how quick this was to do. I could almost flip it over and redo it now. Actually, I'll do that. So we just see. And this time, let me 
And then if neither of these work out, and I'm just gonna tell you, I am using um, thick Whisper White, and that's why it's not showing through. So if <laughs> I did it again, I was, <laughs> I was meaning to put the other. Okay, I'm gonna put them a little closer so they really look like a, we'll see if this one works. And so then this was the deal. It is just on this side. I need to cut off, cut off this, so that when my penguin comes in, you'll see the other part of the foot. So this is making a mistake. It's a good thing, Tim, you have a really short card today, or do you? I'm not sure, because oh, it's a last gonna, minute card. I'm gonna make it last. <laughs> So we were laughing about viewers falling off, you know, if he's taking time, but no, they never fall off when he's there. So, um, and you know, the post-it note is really just enough to do that. So we're going to try this. Okay. So through, through the mat, cause is, see, is see one? now this one's cut out his foot. So it won't matter if his foot goes down in here and we're going to see if this one's any better. <laughs> So now you've seen it again. And really, this would be fun to do with a whole bunch of these. Open that so, so far. And of course, if you tear that, it doesn't work so well for saving. But Oh, much better. Now, do you see how his foot is there? And it really didn't take long at all. I mean, you might think that that's a really fussy, fussy card, but it's not at all. So like fun it. idea. Okay, and now Tim. My turn? Yeah, and I gave him... A whole piece of paper. Did I take your paper? <laughs> I just gave you a piece of paper to... Oh, here we go. Oh, good. This is all Tim has to work with today. So I said, you better just come up with something really quick. Cause, okay, this is quick. Cause, uh, this is great. Yep. This one. Because you didn't have time. I think this one. Okay. He's having the most fun, and Tim is after doing a fun, fun card. That's the thing about live, you know, you see mistakes and everything, you don't, but you know, now, it's also part of the fun of doing this. Thing. Can I apologize ahead of time that I'm going to have to do it in my direction just because mm -hmm. you'll see. Okay. You want to hold that for me, please? Mm -hmm. Or tape it down? <laughs> Seriously. Oh. Tape it down. Oh. Or do oh. something. Here, um, here, just put a little here. Oh. Okay, here we go. Um, where do you want to put the first one? I just want to ask you because I didn't bring a second sheet of paper. I, I think know. you want to put it at this end. Oh, yes. <laughs> and I can't crawl out over to get him. Okay. <laughs> That's wow. great. Okay, there's playful okay, penguin. Now, now, give me black ink. Is this black ink? Um, no, that is white, white chalk ink. And this is probably blue. No, that looks black. Okay. That's black. Oh, that's black. That that's black. Black. Okay, now, this is the, this is what, this is going to make it all make sense. And sometimes when you're not looking directly at, if you can, if you can, if you can in an abstract way, Know what you're drawing. This is very abstract. <laughs> it's a hill. He's going down a hill. He's going down a hill. Isn't that cool? <laughs> now, this is all white down here because it's snow. I kept it white for snow. Um, maybe I should have like blue in the back for sky, but we probably don't have that kind of ink, do we? Um, <laughs> <laughs> I could okay. find you some ink, but not here. Now, but that's it. Black now, and white is now, good. <laughs> now, oh, it actually looks pretty good. See, yeah. Let me just tell you that Karen just said, I know you just you have to make a card, but let's just keep it simple. So this is about as simple as it gets. Because you know, and he's late and he's rushing and he's just coming at the last minute. But you I'm know, glad but having Karen, fun. <laughs> I thought the darkest would be first. <laughs> and it'd be kind of like disappearing. But this is this is the correct. I, I would have let it go if we had another. But since he had put tape on the back, he couldn't really use the back oh, either. So. That's right. <laughs> okay, we'll finish this card and up into it. So the penguin is sledding. Yes, on his own two feet. So okay. See, it's perfect. Let's define this. We this we we okay. are going to finish this. 
Oh, we, we Tim. <laughs> Tim is going to finish this. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Yeah, Connie says we have no ink in our house. Yeah, I, I'm on the far side. I can't get out to go find it. My anything. problem, my problem <laughs> is that I don't do cards unless I'm on the camera. <laughs> so if it's going to get done, it's going to get done by Kara. <laughs> yeah, he's done. Once camera's off, he's I'm done. You finish it. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> so, so all of those who think he sits and stamps with me, he doesn't. I don't. <laughs> oh, pretty... marching penguins would be great too. So the, these are going down the hill, but you know, marching like in a band. I'm trying that to make people great. dizzy. <laughs> okay, so people like your card. We'll okay. finish it up and put it on. So Good. we will get this uploaded. So, so. Um, I just think this is really a fun stamp set and a it great is. stamp set used for guys that isn't just like just nature that you can have fun with. I mean, that can be kind of a, a, a silly, a silly thing too. So my favorite, <laughs> that is so nice. So nice. And I do love that look for the ice. So great yes. thing with that acetate paper. So, okay. Um, thanks everyone. And, hey, hey, um, my dear. We'll have a wonderful weekend, and we'll see you Monday night for a walk through the catalog and watch for about 9 tonight. We're going to be gone this evening, so whenever we get home, I will finish answering comments and then draw the winners. <laughs> <Put that up>. So <laughs> Reminds me of Happy Feet, Lodora says. Is that um, a movie? Was that a movie? Happy Feet? What's Happy Feet? Mm -hmm. Sounds like it. Sounds like a movie to me. But um, um, Okay, and then right. we'll see you Monday night for the other walk through. So have a wonderful weekend. Thanks for joining us. Enjoy the new catalog. And let me know if you have any questions. It's a long walk over to turn this off, so read some more comments. Okay. <laughs> and make sure you go check out the back porch stampers, too. <laughs> oh, it was a kid's movie. Okay, it's on C. Um, we don't watch that. Thanks, all of you. Yep. Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.